How are you guys? It's another Monday down at Frankie's Free Range Meat. A lot of exciting things to talk about and of course you guys get to listen to me complain about losing my mind. Uh, we're actually running like a little behind because last weekend was the New Year so my guys weren't working as much and then hey they decided to not show up a few days so I had to uh, put in a little bit of elbow grease and that's what I used to do you know a few years ago I was doing all the physical work myself but that like translates to me not having the time or energy to do the YouTube, the social media, the customer service and everything else. So I do need to have uh, some people that I can be relatively dependent on. But let me show you guys uh, some new product that we just got in, some farm fresh stuff. And I did want to remind you that <laughs> shipping is free over $100 guys. And we do have the eggs separately on uh, frankyserangefoods.com. So, you know, sometimes you guys will place like an order that's like 80 bucks, which is like $30 of product and expensive shipping. But if you just spend the 20 more dollars, you get the free shipping. And then uh, some of you guys want like smaller quantities of eggs. We do have like three dozen eggs available on frankyserangefoods.com. It's much easier to order them on there if you want a smaller amount. Now, I want to show you guys this first because the local farm fresh dairy is something we've been trying to get for a while. This is a farmer's cheese, so it's very similar to yogurt. It's just really, really fresh cheese that was literally just made uh, the other day. So we do have this available on the website right now. Uh, it's $12 per pound. Very fresh, very affordable. And you know, if we have success with this product, uh, if you guys keep supporting the local Amish farmers, uh, hopefully eventually we can get the butter, the milk, the cream, the yogurt, the kefir, all the other dairy products. So this is a good start to that, but we also have, of course, like all of the other farm cheeses in addition to that. This is just to me, even though it's still technically a cheese, you know, it, it's really close to the products that you guys have been waiting for and looking for. It's packaged really nice, vacuum sealed. So you guys can see it's like a little liquidy on top. Very soft, very, very fresh, plain, you know, great to add honey, maple syrup, some berries for breakfast. Now when we get stuff like that, since it's only good for about a week, you know, we have to sell most of it as fast as possible. Otherwise I lose money and uh, <laughs> I have to, you know, sometimes throw out food in some unfortunate cases. Uh, but in addition to that, we're also gonna have some fresh meat coming soon. So keep an eye out late this week, early next week. Uh, we're gonna do pre-orders on like a fresh meat package. We got a guy that's gonna He's gonna process it like Friday and we'll have the fresh meat to ship out Monday. It's probably gonna be a 10 or 15 pound package and uh, we'll do that soon. So hopefully, you know, as you guys have seen, we, we launched the eggs this year, which was a really big deal. You know, we got Bill Tong in. Everything I say I'm gonna do, it generally happens, although not as quickly as I'd like it to sometimes. So yeah, that's like the main product that I'm excited for this week, but we also got like a few really, really big deliveries of stuff in the freezer that we'll show you. J just before we jump in the freezer, guys, please be patient with the eggs. You know, this is the amount of orders just from like late last week into the weekend. So, you know, it's gonna take us another day or two to get all these egg orders out. I mean, we literally have to, you know, package these eggs up for like three, four, five hours straight. So it's a lot of work. Basically, you know, me and a few other guys are just boxing eggs up the entire day, the entire day. So, you know, although, it's something that we really wanted to add. It's just kind of taking up a lot of time now. So just be a little patient, guys. I know some of you are emailing us because you're not getting your eggs the day after, uh, the day after you order them, but you know, we're not Amazon shipping eggs, guys. And of course, if you do get any broken eggs, which rarely happens, maybe we have like a two or 3%, usually a few eggs are broken and we can just uh, refund you for you know, the amount of eggs as well as compensate you for your time if it made a little bit of a mess. So we have some really great prices on portioned New York strip, ribeye, and sirloin steaks. And we also have 80-20 ground beef back in stock with 85-15 and 93-7. So let's take a look at all these things over here. We have three types of New York strip steaks. So these are 10 ounce portioned New York strip steaks. And guys, these are the most affordable online by far. You know, per pound grass fed steaks, the 10 ounces, we will match any price online. I mean, I'm even willing to go 10% lower than any other price online, although I'm fairly certain these are already the most affordable 10 ounce steaks per pound, 100% grass fed that we have online. New York strip 10 ounces. Uh, we also have New York strip one and a half pounds, which is 
uh, two 12 ounce steaks. So this is just basically the same steak cut a little thicker and it comes in a portion of two. So it's uh, a bit more affordable. It's, it's priced to reflect the larger amount. So we also have New York strip steaks in that larger portion. And then we have organic strip steaks. So a lot of you guys always ask, hey Frank, what's the difference between grass fed and organic? Honestly, to me, I don't really care that much, but you do have to cough up a little bit more uh, per pound for the organic strip steak. So we have a lot of these eight ounce organic strip steaks um, available as well. For the ribeye, we have two different types. So we just have our, our 10 ounce portioned ribeye steak available. And then we have a lot of these eight ounce portioned organic ribeye steak. So on the ribeyes guys, we have 10 ounces and then eight ounce organic. Now for the sirloin steaks, which are a bit more affordable per pound than the ribeye or strip, we have 12 ounces, which is two six ounce sirloin steaks. Very nice, smaller, great for uh, more reasonable portions of meat. Those are organic. And then we have just regular eight ounce sirloin steaks, not organic, little lower price point on these. And I think there's a third sirloin steak somewhere around here. It's a 10 ounce organic sirloin steak. So definitely check those out on the website, guys. Definitely the most affordable price online for organic steaks. And I honestly can't go any lower than that on the price. We got a really good deal uh, from this uh, distributor because they had like a problem in their computer system and they weren't able to list the inventory properly for about like two weeks. So what ended up happening was like all the product that they normally sell, they kind of gave it to me at, at a really good discounted price and it's super, super fresh product too, which is what I was excited about. So ribeye, New York strip, sirloin, check out the website guys. We'll definitely send out a few emails and, uh, and maybe we'll do some deals on like, on like higher volume stuff. If you guys do want to order like a, a bulk amount of them, just uh, send me an email and uh, maybe we can work out like a volume deal. Yeah, so we got some one pound 80, 20 bricks back in stock. Nice portions. The 8515 up here is organic. And then the 937 over here is organic as well. So we got uh, a slightly higher price point on the organic meats. See, this is organic 93.7 ground beef. Oh, we also have some uh, ground ribeye in stock. I think it's 11 or $12 on the website. Just freshly ground steak. And uh, we have some of the organ grind still available. Now those are the smaller portion steaks. If you guys still want just our regular like one pound thick cut steaks, we have them, but uh, per pound, these are a lot more expensive. Oh, almost forgot to show you guys, but they are pretty much sold out. Uh, we only had like seven pork shares left and they're a reduced size. So you get two Italian sausage, two liverwurst, and uh, two pieces of ham. So it, it says what it is on the website, guys, the pork share, but you know, it's only like 50 something dollars. So they were all kind of bought already. Now, after we run out of that pork share, which is like 50 bucks, uh, we're going to be out of ham. So the, the final pork share is just going to be like a pound of Italian sausage and a pound of liverwurst. And we'll have like 10 of them. So that, that's kind of what's going to happen when we get to the end of the, the beef share too, even though we have a little bit of it left. Uh, it's just going to be like a limited amount and a lower price point, which you guys seem to prefer. We did restock the Iberico pork bacon yesterday. A few of you guys said this was a little too thin, so we cut it thicker this time. Here it is. We also got uh, the bone marrow butter back in stock. You know, instead of buying the canoe bones or the pipe bones, you have the pure marrow, but obviously this is like a crazy amount of marrow. So usually it's a little more convenient portion wise to just have the, the bones. I guess one other thing to mention is the ground bison is now $9 a pound. Nine dollars a pound online, guys. Free shipping is unheard of. Plus, you know, if you put in the ten percent discount for orders over three hundred, you're paying like eight dollars a pound for bison shipped to your door. So now you guys know why I'm broke. Yo, I bought my guys this like really expensive glass bottled soda. This little thing was like I, mean, I don't want to talk about price, but they drank it all in like two days, dude. It's like two days. It's half gone. Anyway. So we got the fresh batch of roast beef for you guys. Um, you know, this is prepared on Sunday and chips out Monday, vacuum sealed. So really, really amazing product. 100% grass fed roast beef. I love the convenience of this in sandwiches. I usually have one or two packages a day myself. So let me steal some. This is where they're going to bury me, guys. They're going to go into my pyramid made out of styrofoam coolers. And inside is just going to be more cardboard and like bubble wrap shipping supplies.
I don't really get them anymore, but sometimes people email me about like eco-friendly stuff and like, oh, the styrofoam coolers. You know what's less eco-friendly? <laughs> Having 20 pounds of meat thaw out on your doorstep and go to waste because you didn't want a styrofoam cooler. So, you know, I guess the cooler is definitely the lesser of the evils if we're comparing it to these uh, eco-friendly things that don't really keep the meat cold. So I'm not gonna go into too much detail on the new supplements guys because I've been showing you these every week and we've been doing a lot of videos on them uh, but I have been enjoying them a lot for convenience and just uh, taking different ones every day whether it's the digestive enzymes the B vitamins or the minerals if you guys do want the freeze-dried glands on organ supplements we're kind of doing like the final liquidation so I don't know if we're going to be able to get anything back in stock I'm trying to get uh, some brains and some testicles because those two powders are really popular so maybe 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 not 100% sure yet. Wi-Fi shielding, guys, all of the tank tops, underwear, t-shirts, everything is 10% on liquidation sale. We have the foldable canopies in stock, but we will be getting the regular canopies, the drapes that hang down, uh, hopefully by the end of this week, early next week. And then uh, Frankie's Naturals, guys, everything is in stock for the most part. Here's the hair pomade. Hair pomade, black soap, everything is in stock, guys. Uh, so I guess I'll give you guys an idea of the game plan, what's going on. So most of you know that, you know, my landlord is kicking me out. So uh, we're going to have to relocate in a few months. Still don't know where yet. I uh, had a property, but the deal fell through. So um, it looks like we should be fine. Well, there's a few things on the table that, you know, I have a few options. Just depends on if I can take my employees with me. And the main thing I'm focusing on is uh, if we can keep the sales high and consistent, then when like a meat packing plant or a slaughterhouse deal shows up, we show those sales to the bank and we get a loan on it. That's kind of what I'm banking on here because, you know, after we get that new property and we have to move everything over and all those expenses, you know, the main thing that's going to actually make the business, you know, sustainable and have all the products we want and everything is, is doing it ourselves. But obviously that's not where we're moving to now because of these circumstances. So I'm losing my mind a little bit, guys. I've been down here way too much. I'm kind of living off of uh, Biltong and Tatomi's cookie bars. So uh, we're actually reaching out to some other Amish people this week to see if we can get some more potato chips. But I guess that's gonna be it for this week, guys. You can go to frankiestrangemeat.com, frankiestrangefoods.com to see all of our interesting products and support us. Uh, all the businesses, the other stuff too, guys, is on frank defoundcom as I said earlier, uh, just be a little patient, guys, with, with all of the eggs and the foods orders. All of the meat has been going out, like, next day as quickly as possible on schedule. It's just the eggs, in some cases, are taking us, like, a few days for them to ship out. And since, you know, the eggs aren't being shipped express in some cases, it might take, like, a day or two for them to get to you. So, guys, just, just be a little more patient with the egg orders, but they are going out, and you should have them by the end of this week. As I said, guys, frank Thanks for joining. As usual, please drop a like on the video, leave a comment down below, subscribe so that YouTube can unsubscribe you next week, and be sure to check that notification bell so they don't notify you of my videos. I'll see you guys soon.